What's going on everyone? Xylus back here with you with part 12 of MGS5, The Lightning Ops. We're going to be going through mission 13, Pitch Dark, in this episode. And this is our first venture into Africa. So new location, but same great gameplay. Enjoy. Came from Intel. The target is Angola's Mfinda oil field, upstream from the landing point. A spill has covered the whole area and crude. A pipeline that crosses the Muneni River failed, and now the shore's a mess. Not to mention the villages downstream have no drinking water. Damn. That's no way to live. I've got to stop it. Cause, where exactly is the oil coming from? The oil runs to the pipeline from that facility. Taking it out should end the leak. The client this time is an environmental NGO. Destroy the facility. Stop that leak. This may seem like straight-up philanthropy, but there's another reason we agreed to it. The Mafinda oil field was outdated. Abandoned. Then the rebel group Unita moved in, taking it upon themselves to kickstart operations. Unita's been rapidly modernizing its arsenal. Rumor has it someone's been selling them US military hardware. Intel's analysis suggests the broker's a front company, Cyphers. Keeping tabs on United can tell us who's pulling its strings. So there's more going on here than they would like us to believe. And of course, it's always the innocent civilians that get caught in the middle. I'll sort it out. Looks like the facility is quite a ways north. I'll have to find some form of transportation to cut down the distance. Otherwise, it's going to be a long walk. Yeah, the water's in pretty bad shape here, Cos. Such a beautiful place. It's a damn shame. The war industry we started has taken a pretty crooked course these past nine years. With no other options, soldiers have become dogs of war. Sent to conflict zones as private forces, or PFs. Guys we fought alongside are dying all around the globe for no reason. No banner. But it's how they survive. The demand for PFs here in Africa is especially high. Cold War standoffs, resource exploitation, tribal clashes. What's big business for developed countries has only brought conflict here. That mess you're standing in is just the latest example. Enemy presence detected. Yeah. The map has There's been always updated. consequences for every action. And it's always the little guys who suffer. Always. Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Masa Village. It's been turned into a supply hub for Unida, meaning it'll be stocked with weapons and resources. Should be a thing or two that'll come in handy. Don't be shy. They deserve to be in better hands. Analysis complete. Huh. The map has been I'll see updated. what I can find. But hell, I'd just settle for some wheels. Cause, they've definitely got some equipment all right. Claymore mines. Military great body armor and top of the line weapons. They're getting some help from somewhere, no doubt about it.
Enemy presence detected. The map has been updated. Analysis complete. Weather will clear shortly. Analysis complete. Soldiers. Boss, do not hurt any child soldiers. If you do, the mission is over. He's coming too. Roger that. I know more than anyone what it's like to be a child soldier. There's no way in hell I'm leaving him here to live this life. No child deserves it. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Affirmative. Take good care of him, Kaz. I'll send more if I find him. I've made 
made it through the village, advancing north. Ah, just what I needed. I'm sure they won't mind if I take it off their hands. Roger, heading there now. But it looks like they've set up checkpoints along the main road. Time to make my own detour. Mathinda oil field is the property of Saner, South African Natural Resources. Saner drills oil wells wherever they can throughout that region. When the oil dries up, they abandon the facility. And it's only a matter of time before the aging equipment starts leaking crude. That means United's takeover is the perfect cover for Saner. Now they can blame the spill on a bunch of oil thieves. However you look at it, Saner's far from squeaky clean. Of course they're dirty. It's all about money, cause. Whoever has the money has the power. Or so they think. It won't go unpunished. Maybe not today or tomorrow. But one day, those responsible for this will pay dearly. to wonder why such a heavy guard for an outdated oil facility. They couldn't be making it more obvious if they tried. Analysis complete. complete.
I've reached the separator tank. Preparing to plant charges. You gotta extract him. Heading towards the main power building now. present for you. Merry Christmas. There's the trace for a pump control room. The emergency stop button is probably inside it. I think I'm standing right in front of it. What the hell? Cos, you seeing what I'm seeing? Plot just thickened. Extraction. Oil Around transfer pump shut off confirmed. Next, destroy the oily water separator tank. That'll ensure they can never use the facility again. With pleasure. Whatever sickening madness is going on here, it stops today. The charges have already been set. I'm making my way out of the facility. I'll detonate once I'm clear. Out.
All clear. Commencing detonation. You destroyed the separator tank. Objectives complete. Though security will be tighter after that explosion. Get out of there ASAP. Way ahead of you, Kaz. I don't plan on sticking around to find out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to wrap up part 12 of Metal Gear Solid 5, The Lighting Ops. We're just extracting here. Uh, but I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching these videos, uh, those of you who are. And uh, hope you're enjoying them as much as I am enjoying making them for you. These missions are just getting better and better here, and I'm having a blast putting them together. Uh, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below, um, or like it, or dislike it, however you feel. Feel free to just kind of engage a little bit and let me know what you think of these videos or this series. I would really appreciate it. And be sure to subscribe if you, if you want to see more of this. Uh, definitely more of this kind of content in the future as well. I'll be doing more stuff like this for other games as well, not just Metal Gear. But uh, if you guys like it, give it a like. And I uh, hope you guys will keep coming back for the next episodes to come. I will see you guys later. Xylus out.